Hey you, I'm Danny Paul. I'm that girl who is passionate about dresses, high heels and hosiery. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell button so we're always gonna be connected. Today I decided that I'm gonna show you some outfit ideas you can wear to Thanksgiving party. By the way, do you celebrate it? For my first outfit, I decided why not to wear something comfy but still cute. And this is exactly how I ended up choosing this dress. I love this figure hugging dress. It looks flattering. Do you agree? It takes some time to put it on. There are way too many buttons on it. But when you get home, all tired, and all you want to do is go to bed and chill while watching something fun, it takes literally a second to take it off. Rather practical, I guess, right? As for the tights, they're not basic. They have this lovely pattern on top. So cute. I also decided to give some character to this outfit by wearing these high heels. Leopard print can be hard to pull off, but you're good to go if you wear something tranquil on top. By saying that, basic black outfit would look great with these shoes. It's a party, right? So let's put on something festive. This skirt is one of my favorites. It has two layers. A silk underskirt and this net-like see-through top. The texture of the upper layer is incredible. It's squishy. So it's really fun to touch it. Trust me. I paired this curry with my burgundy lawn sleeve and black tights, keeping it simple, I guess. As for the shoes, the classics would work magically. And here I present you the comfy modern princess look. That's exactly how this skirt makes me feel. I feel like swirling around literally non-stop. Burgundy screams fall to me. Does it have the same effect on you? This fall leather skirt is almost perfect for an occasion. It's also gonna keep your legs warm as the length of it is quite significant. The buttons in front make it super easy to put on and if your soul desires to do some con con at the end of the party, of course, in the right moment, then you're good to go, as you can easily unbutton it a little bit, of course, and do your fun dance. I also find beige and burgundy do magic together. They are extremely appealing. And the golden details on the sleeves and the golden buttons look fantastic. 
As for the shoes, I decided to wear these shoes with the wild print. The shoes don't look too much as the colors are from the same group. Okay, before you point it out, I noticed rather late that I read my thoughts. And I feel really sad about it as this pair is really unique and I found it in the store some time ago on a shelf completely forgotten. I will try to fix them my eyes as I dig them way too much. But back to the look. Burgundy skirt, a different one this time, shorter and of a different material. I usually wear beige, burgundy, white or black with the burgundy color, but I decided to try something new and I picked this pink sweater. Zero regrets, as they look way too cute together. As for the shoes? I decided to wear these funky heels. If you wonder how I walk in them, they're extremely comfy and give you a fun sensation when you walk. Kinda squishy, really amusing. Yeah, the bottoms are pink, a different shade of pink from the top but still. So, do you dig this look? Who's this fluff star? <laughs> Pink is my favorite color, as you might know, but I also enjoy wearing fluffy things. So it's a win-win for me. Fluffy and pink. I decided to cover my legs with a pair of tan tights just to keep it in the same color shape. As for the shoes, you will see what I chose in a second. I picked Pigal Folie in the nude shade. Pink is a tricky color, usually considered immature and difficult to style. But again, have fun and don't be scared to try different things. And for those who like unusual colors but too afraid to wear them, try by styling these colors with the neutral ones to stay on the safer side. As for this set, it's quite practical, warm and stretchy. This fluffy pencil skirt doesn't make you walk funny. And just look at all that fluff. I have a question for you. Do you like oversized clips? And are they really that comfy? Some of them definitely are, but quite often they don't look that great or aren't that comfy. I prefer a fitted look, but I do have different oversized clothing pieces like this one. Can be confusing how to wear it. So I decided to put a white blouse under to add some color and a different texture. And this time I wanted to give it a fitter look by adding a belt. And it worked. It looks wonderful. You agree? By the way, check out my Instagram, Tatiana Paulava, to see more pictures. Also, have you noticed small red hearts on my tights? It kind of made me choose the right pumps to wear with this outfit. No regrets at all. I love jumpsuits. They're also extremely comfy, as long as you don't need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> yeah. The jumpsuit I got in New York some years ago, still one of my favorites. I was shopping with my friends and I got out of a fitting room to have a better look and ask my friends for their opinion. 
And there were people outside like, girl, you look great, you gotta get it. It was a really sweet moment and I believe we should be nicer to one another. As for the shoes, I opted for these dash Pito platform heels to make my last look even longer. I also feel like I could be a character in the Ghostbusters movie and this is going to be my outfit to go on a ghost hunt. Who are you going to call? Ghostbusters! Right now you might be witnessing some very particular moves that I got when I'm trying to put on jeans. I decided to wear something more casual like a white bodysuit, a pair of jeans and a sweater just to be sure I'm not getting cold. As for the shoes, I'm bringing back my funky pink soft heels. Thank you for sticking till the end. I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit the bell button so we're always gonna be in touch. If you wanna see more of my content or you're just willing to say hi to me, feel free to reach out. I'll drop the links as usually in the description box below. Have a fabulous day. And I'll see you very soon. Bye.